At least 17 Israeli airstrikes on Beirut's southern suburbs alone. At least six buildings there levelled. Ongoing strikes right across the country, with the Lebanese army saying three of its soldiers, including an officer, have been killed during the evacuation of injured people in a southern village. Israeli jets also were striking multiple buildings in the coastal city of Tyre, sending up large clouds of black smoke. Well, a short while ago, I spoke to our senior reporter in Beirut, Catherine Norris-Trent. Once again, Beirut is waking up this morning to, well, smoke rising from the southern suburbs after a heavy night of airstrikes. 17 Israeli airstrikes pounded the south of Beirut overnight. Um, the uh, National News Agency says six buildings were collapsed and we're starting to get some casualty figures there. At least one person killed and five others injured, according to the Lebanese health ministry there. They were particularly loud explosions that uh, shook buildings across the city. But this has been happening for the past few nights and days now after a, a period of perhaps more relative quiet. Meanwhile, in the south of the country, three Lebanese soldiers, including an officer, were killed in an Israeli airstrike when they were trying to evacuate wounded civilians from a village right down in the south near the blue line, the border with Israel. That was in near the Bint Jabal area as well. So uh, the U.S. has expressed its concern to Israel about the, the killing of a number of Lebanese soldiers on the ground. Meanwhile, Israel said that over the past day it hit 160 Hezbollah targets in ground and airstrikes. So they're very much continuing that offensive there in the south and also across the country. Catherine Norris, trend there.